हेलो बच्चो द क्वेश्चन से डेट एन अल्टरनेटिंग ई एम एफ इज इक्वल टू फोर फोर्टी साइन हंड्रेड पाई टी इज अप्लाइड टू अ सर्किट कंटेनिंग एन इंडक्शन ऑफ रूट टू बाई पाई हेनरी इफ एन ए सी आम मीटर इज कनेक्टेड इन द सर्किट इट्स रीडिंग विल बी सो वी विल सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वील सी वट विल बी द की कंसेप्ट इज इन दिस क्वेश्चन द की कंसेप्ट Used in this question will be a C M meter reads I R M S value reads R M S value of current flowing in the circuit current flowing in the circuit. So the A C M meter reads R M S value of the current flowing in the circuit. Now we have been given the value of inductance l is equal to root over 2 by pi henry and we have emf e is equal to 440 sin 100 pi t now comparing this with the standard form of emf that is e not sin omega t we will have e not that is peak value of emf is 440 volt and omega will be equal to 100 pi so we will have xl that is inductive resistance that will be equal to omega into l that will be 100 pi multiplied by l is root over 2 by pi so this will give xl is equal to 100 root 2 ohm this will be the value of xl now we have been given i rms we have to find i rms sorry we have to find i rms now first we will find i not that is peak value of current that will be equal to e not that is peak value of voltage by inductive resistance xl so that will be equal to 440 by 100 root 2 so i not will be equal to 2.2 root 2 2.2 Root two ampere. This will be the value of I not. Now we know that I RMS is equal to peak value of current divided by root two. So I not by root two. So that will be equal to two point two root two by root two. So that will be equal to two point two ampere. So the value of I RMS will be two point two ampere. So the final answer is option B. Hope you all understood it well. Best of luck.